So today I'm joined by Jane and Alexandra from Giga and also by Michael from Barcelona City Council. Welcome, thank you all for joining me here on the panel. It's great to have you here. I turn first to Jane, who is the Senior Advisor and Panel Chair. Thank you for joining me. Can you tell me a bit about what Giga is and what the session that you put on today covered? Absolutely. Giga is an ambitious UN project of two UN agencies, the ITU, the International Telecommunication Union, and UNICEF. It's the first time two huge agencies of this nature have come together to connect schools. We're trying to connect all the schools in the world to the internet by 2030. We're doing that by mapping where schools are and whether they're connected, by modeling where the infrastructure is, uh, by contracting, helping them buy goods, and also financing. Absolutely, and that's not the only thing you've been working on this show. Connectivity is so important, but you're also focusing on partnerships as well. And I think that's where Alexandra comes in, who's the partnership specialist here at Giga. So, Alexandra, could you tell me, um, how is Giga partnering with institutions to ensure universal school connectivity? What's the secret? Well, thank you for this question. Uh, partnerships have really played a pivotal role in Giga's growth. So we believe that a shared purpose and mutual understanding is those are factors that really enable us to, to achieve successes. Uh, we receive a lot of support from uh, ministry, Spanish Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Catalan government and Barcelona City Council. And thanks to them, we have been able to open a technology center in Barcelona. And this has been a perfect location for us to engage with a vibrant ecosystem. But we are also cooperating with the private sector and they are providing us with data, technology, in-kind support that is allowing us to scale our efforts. So with Dell, we have been able to map and scale our mapping efforts using AI uh, technology. With Ericsson, we have been able to build an application that help us monitor real time, uh, uh, in real time, the quality of internet. We've also worked with IHS towers. So all those collaborations have been really instrumental. And as we scale in 2024, uh, we hope to be able to expand our base of, of partners, both from public and private sector. So I turn now to Michael Donaldson from Barcelona City Council. Obviously, ISE itself has had a huge impact on Barcelona, but how do you see Giga and its tech offerings? What has its impact on the city of Barcelona been? Well, having a UN agency in the city of Barcelona by itself, it's a huge impact. It creates a lot of dynamics all around the goal that they are trying to pursue, trying to cover all internet in the schools all around the world. We're talking about a result of a collaboration between the Spanish government, the autonomous government from Catalonia, and the city council government of Barcelona. So that's also another message that's very important. Now, knowing that Barcelona is the capital of the mobile, we're having the ESE, we're having the mobile, we're having the Smart City Expo, having projects such as Giga, which is a kind of a gift that Barcelona is sending to the rest of the world. It's really, really great for Barcelona, really great for the ecosystems, for the startups, for the NGOs, and really great for the city and the citizens of Barcelona. Absolutely. There's plenty to shout about here. Michael, thank you so much for your time. Thanks a lot. Thank you.